Alright you guys, so it is actually now the next day. Like I told you guys, we're going to do part two on the next day. It's a beautiful day out, nice and sunny. And we're actually heading to Autobahn Tent Shop right now where my buddy Tommy's getting his 2022 CL11 LE tinted. And then we're going to actually go into getting videos inside of the car. And like I said, the drone shots we talked about. So we're heading out there to meet up with him right now while his car gets tinted. But in the meantime, you know, you went and got a haircut. Had to clean it up. Look a little, feel good, look good, you know. That's what you gotta do. So, we're gonna go ahead up there. When we get there, we're gonna check out the car. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, let him get his windows tinted. And then we're gonna finish this video for you guys. All right, you guys. So, we're out here at the park right now. We just got done having uh, Tommy's windows tinted. And what'd you end up getting? Uh, did 5% all the way around in a... 50% front with the eyebrow. One more time. One more time. Yeah, one more time. One more time. Okay. One more time. okay. We did 5% uh -huh. all the way around. Uh -huh. And we did 50 with an eyebrow on it. All right. So, yeah, we went to Autobahn Window Tent in here. And was it considered Mom or still North Little Rock? Or Little Rock? It's technically North Little Rock side. All right. So, technically North Little Rock. So, we have a sponsorship with them. Thank you, Coop Stay Wildin' for getting that for us. But yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and take a look on the inside. Like I said, we're gonna show you guys the ins and outs, the specs on this car. So we're gonna check that out. We're gonna check out the tent. It looks good. You can't see anything, as you can see from the drone shots all the way around the car. You can't see in it at all. We're gonna check out the carbon fiber that come with it, the Alcantara steering wheel. Like we're gonna check out everything, and I hope you guys enjoy it. And this is gonna be the part two that we were talking about. Start. Yeah. Well, I'm technically not done with anything in here yet, since, you know, it's already had the suede interior that it come with an Alcantara or whatever it is, with all the red stitching that's came in since 17. But the add-ons that I did not ask for, but it was one of them deals, when I found the car, it came with it anyway. Pretty much the red knee pads that are in there, that was an option that was added in to the car in the order. The uh suede chevy emblem uh armrest that was another option that was in there on it that i wouldn't have done but it's fine right now i love it uh people who do not know these red seat belts is not standard no more they stopped doing that after 18. they're now a paid for option more money <laughs> of course <laughs> more money i've already added my carbon fiber uh shift levers back on there and everything i kind of trying to remember what else i put in here so far well you kind of have to see it from the other side but some of my other carbon on stuff has been added in i'll go to the other side yeah yeah some of my carbon out of stuff has already been added in on the on the other side i still got to order that trim i was going to do this i have it i don't want it so i'm going to probably leave it there just to kind of break it up. I was also going to do the rings. I have them, and I, that just kind of, it's just not going to happen anymore. Some of the things I had in the plan, they're just in my mind. Now, after seeing it again and doing it a second time, I just don't want it. So, All right. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that, but you know, definitely a beautiful spec on the car. Like I said, <laughs> definitely in a higher end. Oh, and the carbon fiber automatic shift lever, that was an option put in. It's not like the other one where it was actually uh, Alcatara. That uh -huh. is a totally different deal. That was okay, I didn't even notice that. That was a good catch. I didn't even notice that, dude. Yeah, totally different from the other one. Uh, it's pretty much we know we're looking at the 1L Lee package. The option out about $7,500 is what it optioned out for. And basically, you, if nobody knows what it is, I mean, you're getting the wing, carbon fiber wing. You automatically get the carbon fiber hood scoop. You ended up getting the 19 inch wheels. Uh, it's got the DDDS uh, shocks on it for track purposes and all that. Uh, also, it comes with red calibers. Which everybody's probably seen. That is automatically, that's an option you gotta pay for. The winglets come in that package and Everything about the grill, which this grill is more aggressive than it because it's more open. No people have probably seen it and already heard about it, but 
you see the difference in person versus when you actually seen it on the car. It is a totally different thing. It's way more open. This splitter is crazy to me because it's so much more out and the car is so much lower. I mean, it wasn't it bagging into my driveway. That thing is probably like two or three inches from scraping. <laughs> That low life. <laughs> yeah, low life on it. And then unfortunately it comes with basically the Goodyear Cup 3 sport tires, which ain't good for the street for nothing. But it is what it is. Oh, and another thing it comes in the package besides the black right before the oil leads, you get the black mirrors. Okay. And all that stuff. You do get that. Now, since that I also added this morning. I went ahead and changed out the fuel cover. Put that on this morning. Just as something to do real quick. Uh, as far as the rest of the cosmetic stuff we're going to do, we're going to put the rock guards on later tonight sometime. And I'll have the side markers put on. And on the back, we'll go ahead and black out the reflectors on the, bo on the bottom. And I got something special for these lights that's going in there. I'm going to see how it works out. That will be pretty much, other than some probably ceramic and clear coat, no, uh, PBF. That is it for the car. It's going to be done. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and get some shots of this beautiful car, get a little montage going, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Yeah. 